Hi guys, it's Sarah from Book Nerds and Fangirls, and today I'm continuing with my Pride Month Color of Me series. Today we're gonna be uh, doing this picture and doing the traditional Pride Month flag. Also, I would like to make a quick note that my hands do kind of look like shit today, but that's because I was making a fun film video for you guys. I thought it was pretty fun and I had to use food dye for it. So, uh, that's why my hands look kind of ratchet today, but it's fun. Fun. They, they're not the worst that they've ever been. So today we're doing the traditional gay pride flag. This is the flag most associated with Pride Month. Month, but before I delve into coloring, a little bit of history on this flag, as always. Always, so like I said, this is the most familiar fla flag for Pride. In 1979, the community landed on this six color version, which was hung from lampposts in San Francisco's numerous complications over. Oh, in San. Francisco. Okay. Numerous complications over having an odd number of colors led to turquoise being dropped. At least according to reports, read more about the modern flag here. So, I'm reading this from the website pride.com. Com. So if you want more information about all the flags, it will be on there. On there, and I think this is probably one of the most frustrating flags to get colors for because the colors are so specific, and there's no way I could just vary colors in there. But I appreciate you guys so much that I'll do all these flags. Flags. I'll be doing the Philadelphia People of Color Inclusion flag next time. Time and I'm excited for that one. Oh, and by I'll also be doing all the pride flags. Flags, including like numerous ones that I never knew existed. Existed. It's just crazy how much you don't know until you like research it. But, so without further ado, this is the drawing we're working on. I decided to do a very simple drawing today because my other videos have been really long. Long, like my uh, 19, I think 79 to 9. Hold on, it's like right here. Here too. My 1978 to 1999 one was in two parts because I picked one that was like super complicated. But this one probably won't be, so we're gonna start off right here. I don't know if you can see it or not. I'm gonna do the outside Celtic knots first. I think this is a Celtic knot. Now comment down below if you know what these are called. Called. I thought this would be a pretty interesting one to do. I'm gonna move my husband's magic cards right here. Here, and we're gonna get into it. Also, uh, after this video, I will link down my other Pride Month color of me. Me's at the end of the video. Video, I'm like super excited for all of Pride Month. I have a lot of ideas for Pride Month, hence my hands being kind of dyed with food coloring. Coloring, I shot that video yesterday and I'll have to edit it. at some point in the day, but I'm busy shooting other Pride Month videos. So it's gonna be like a day, but I'm happy to shoot because I pre-film videos. 
because I have such a busy work schedule. So I have no choice but to pre-film or else it all gets... I won't feel like I have to finish the video and I really want to finish my videos for this month. Because like I said, Pride Month is probably one of my favorite months out of the year. Year June has always been an awesome month. Months like June and July are like my two favorite months. July, I'm a little biased on because it's my birthday month, but you know what they say. So, so in the month of July, if you want like birthday themed videos for what I do for my birthday, comment down below. Let me know, because I'm like... Happy to film any video for you guys. I just can't do vlogging outside because I wouldn't know how I would do that. Because I record most of my stuff on a webcam.
Alright, guys. That was the last part. Part. So, this is the full drawing right here. Well, full picture right here. I think it turned out rather great, but what do you guys think? Comment down below. I will leave my other Pride Mum videos around here somewhere. Here somewhere, so you could go check them out. I'm ha so excited to be doing the rest of my Pride Mum videos, and I hope you guys enjoy these. These, and I will see you guys in my next Pride Month Color of Me Well Out, where I will be doing the Philadelphia People of Color inclusive flag. So I'll talk to you guys later. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe if you like what you see here. Here, and don't forget to check out any of my other videos. Bye!